everybody. My name is Miss Susan. My name is Emma. I am eight years old and the oldest of three girls. And today we are going to be reading together Jesus Calling for Little Ones, written and read by permission by Sarah Young. Even though we're apart, we hope reading this book to bring our families together. Jesus Calling for Little Ones. Written by Sarah Young, illustrated by Antonia Woodward, a Jesus Calling book. The Father has loved us so much. He loved us so much that we are called children of God. 1 John 3, 1. I made you and you are my child. I created everything. All of my creations from the sun, ocean, flowers, big fish, and tiny butterflies. My children are my favorite. I know your every thought, every feeling, every hope and dream. I know everything about you. Even the number of hairs on your head. I made you in an amazing and wonderful way. God even knows how many hairs are on your head. Matthew 10, 30. If you look to the heavens, I am there. If you look to the bottom of the ocean, I am there. I am everywhere. You can be sure I am always with you. You can be sure that I will be with you always. Matthew 28, 20. You, can, you cannot see me with your with your eyes or hear me with your ears, but I am he here with you. My voice is like a quiet whisper in your heart. Trust in me, little one. Believe in me. We live by what we believe, not by what we can see. Second Corinthians 5, 7. Every good action and every perfect gift is from God. James 1, 17. Every good gift in your life is from me, your family and friends, the bright sun and tall trees, playful puppies and sleepy kittens. Look around at all of the wonder wonderful things I have for you. When you pray, remember to thank me. Thank me for my kindness and my blessing. Thank me for everything. Thank the Lord because he is good. His love continues forever. First Chronicles 16.34 I care about everything that happens to you. Do not worry. I will take care of you. Do not worry about anything, but pray and ask God for everything you need. And when you pray, always give thanks. Philippians 4.6 some things are a little scary, but you do not need to be afraid. You can be brave. I am right here with you. Don't be afraid, because I am your God. Isaiah 41.10 Forgive each other, because the Lord forgave you. Colossians 3.13 Stay close to me. I am here to forgive you. When, when you do wrong, forgiveness is my free gift to you. And when you forgive others, the light of my love glows through you like a candle shining in the darkness. I want my children to be filled with joy. Laugh with me. I created laughter. Lord, you have made me happy by what you have done. I will sing for joy about what your hands have done. Psalm 92.4 I have a good plan for you fun plans for your day, big palms for you tomorrow, great plans for the rest of your life. I have good plans for you. I plan to give you hope and a good future. Jeremiah 29 11. I am waiting to hear from you, little one. Tell me what is in your heart. Whisper my name, Jesus. Thank me for all the wonderful blessings and good things I, have, I gave you. I give you. Pray and know that I will always hear you. Never stop praying. 1 Thessalonians 5.17 Staying close to me is all about love. My love for you and your love for me. You can be sure from your head to your toes that I love you. And I will love you forever.
Love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, and strength. Deuteronomy 6.5